this is Victoria Wynn of Wynn Modern Art. So this color right here is called Cobalt. Pieces are a little chunkier than some of the other Wynn Modern Art um, Lux Crushed Mirror. As you can see, these are they're a little bit bigger. And what I'm doing today is showing you what to do when you don't absolutely love your piece. Like, it's nice, but you know, like maybe it, it just needs a little something. And this one, I've had this for a few months and had it hanging on the wall in the gallery and really just been trying to decide what, what it needed for me. And well, it occurred to me today. And then it also occurred to me that I should share my tricks with you. I have bottles of Floetrol. This is Flood Floetrol you get from Home Depot, Lowe's, Amazon. And again, this is the Wind Modern Art Crushed Mirror and the color is Cobalt. And I thought, holy crap, I don't think this is meant to be just a black and white piece. What if I added this beautiful blue? So here's how you do it after your piece is dry. Because usually you'll watch me do videos and my piece is wet. And that's how this uh, crushed mirror in clear was adhered while the paint was still wet. So one thing about the clear and the antique colors is that it takes on some of the paint color beneath it, which gives it really beautiful, um, like illusion of like black diamonds. So here is where there is no black paint. And then here you can see it kind of does an ombre effect so that happens in the colors clear and antique, but this has an actual color, so it's gonna show up. It's a beautiful blue, cobalt. I have two different blues. One blue is, well, why don't I show a comparison actually? Let's see. I happen to have it, have it in the showcase right here. So this is more of a, it's a softer blue and the pieces are a bit smaller. So there's our side by side of cobalt compared to blue. Um, Cause on the website, this is just called blue. So both beautiful. And I almost went with this for the black and white piece. And then, you know, sometimes you're just in a bold mood. So I thought, I would go bold and use just a, a brighter blue. I love that other one that's um, this called Just Blue. I love that one, especially for ocean pieces. So what I do is kind of decide where I would like to see more glass. Um, I'm wondering if I'm going to... Um, stick with what I've got going here, which is, it's kind of like there's four quadrants here, down here, one up here, and then one over here. That's obviously all up to me and you don't have to worry about that. Um, but I will show you, there we go. I will show you just simply what it looks like to add my, Flow trough from the bottle. And maybe I will just go all the way like this. Remember that flow trough dries clear, so don't worry about the white, you know, not looking nice and things such as that. It will go away, give it a day or two. So I pour straight from the cup and I go back and forth. Now, because these are bigger pieces, you're gonna take a few seconds to, you know, the ones that might, um, sometimes they'll fall upright instead of down like that. So just, you know, have a Zen moment here and lay the pieces down and 
enjoy the process. There's no reason that we need to be rushing or, you know, hurrying up to make things beautiful faster. It's just, and it sounds silly when I say it, but you might be surprised about how many people feel like they have to rush beauty. You know, this piece has been sitting here um, you know, pretty much unfinished. I just had it hanging on the wall until I could decide what, what I wanted to do with it. And then today was the day, months later. So patient, you know? Okay. I am loving this. This cobalt is, it's so gorgeous. My little puppy right here, his name is Chowder. And Chowder, whenever he hears me making these videos, he gets off of his little, little couch bed that I have for him at the studio. And he wants to see who I'm talking to. <laughs> He's like, will they pet me? <laughs> okay, so for right now, for the sake of this video, I'm not going on like all day or something. Let me just show you what that looks like. Remembering that the flow trawl will dry clear. And I might add some more, um, cause that blue is really, it just, it, it added something amazing to this piece. So, well, thanks for joining me as I share some of my sneaky tricks with you. Again, this is Victoria Wynn. WinnModernArt.com is where you can get items like this and then all these different beautiful colors of powders and mirror and that's where to come for it. <laughs>